Liquor prices in Pennsylvania are going up Sunday, as Money Editor John Delano reports. It affects most products and comes as a surprise to many. The Pennsylvania Liquor Control Board is raising prices on its most popular alcohol products by 4% beginning this Sunday, January 15th. We're experiencing increased costs uh, across the board, whether it's from our store leases, our distribution costs, our labor costs, uh, just general acquisition costs. Sean Kelly with the Liquor Control Board says the state's fine wine and spirit stores are affected by inflation like everyone else. Right now, 4% is the right amount. Our team took a very long time to uh, look at what 4% means for our bottom line and what it means for our customers. We, we did not undertake this lightly. While the cost of selected items go up frequently at these state stores, this is the first across the board hike, affecting 3,500 products since 2019. Depending on the price of the liquor you purchase, the price hike could range from 50 cents a bottle to several dollars on your favorite adult beverage. Some lawmakers are critical. Didn't last year you just announced you had record-breaking profits? Now you're going to raise prices? That doesn't really make sense. State Senator Mike Regan, who chairs the Senate committee responsible for the Liquor Control Board, says the liquor monopoly in this state allows for such a large-scale price hike. If this was a private business, the actual raising of prices would probably be the last thing that they would do. The first thing they would do would be try to cut their own costs, and they would look at you know how they're how they're um, how they're staffed. That's not the only criticism of the price hike. We'll have some of the other concerns new at six. In the meantime, if you want to save a few bucks on wine and spirits, buy before Sunday. John Delano, KDKA News.